If you don't clean your kitchen exhaust fan regularly, sooner or later it will covered with grime and dripping oil. When it reaches that state, you would regret that you hadn't cleaned it earlier. Looking for the best grease remover would be your most sensible response. Likewise, as years go by, our conscience will be numbed and polluted. External rituals or deeds wouldn't do anything to our numbed and polluted conscience. The author of Hebrews clearly points out that the blood of Jesus Christ not only cleanses our conscience, but his salvation also sets us free to serve the living God. That's powerful, isn't it? Let's ponder Hebrews 9.14. How much more then will the blood of Christ, who through the eternal Spirit offered himself unblemished to God, cleanse our conscience from acts that lead to death, so that we may serve the living God? Let's pose a question to God. How can I get to know that you are the living God? Let's practice what you learned. If you are a non-believer, ask Jesus to cleanse your conscience so that you can serve the living God. Let's proclaim to others about your experiential knowledge. Share your conversion experience with a non-Christian. 